Hi everyone, I'm Josh Carney. I'm a professional audio engineer and technology specialist, and I'm here to talk to you about SCA, an incredibly versatile new standard for wireless audio. The SCA standard was developed to transmit wireless audio signals from virtually any device, including mobile phones and tablets. SCA transmitters are available for iPhones and iOS devices, as well as for Android devices. Laptop and desktop computers can be connected using a USB transmitter, and these are just some very common uses for SCA. With SCA, you can transmit a high fidelity, low latency wireless audio signal from your phone or other portable device to headphones or a portable speaker like this. Now traditionally we'd use Bluetooth to do this, but there's some pretty big problems with Bluetooth when it comes to wireless audio. One of the biggest problems with Bluetooth is that you have to pair your devices, and it's frustrating to continually try to pair your Bluetooth device and not have it work properly. Everything that is difficult about traditional wireless technology has been simplified with SCA. With SCA, all we have to do is find the appropriate uh, transmitter for our device, plug it in, I'll pull up a song in iTunes, and press play. And just like that, we have sound. A second big problem with Bluetooth is the latency. Uh, latency is just a noticeable lag or delay in the audio signal, and this is a big problem if you're watching a movie or a video or playing a game on your tablet. You don't want to hear a noticeable lag between what you see on the screen and what you're hearing. If you're playing a game that you downloaded from the App Store, the last thing you want to have happen is have the, the game sound effects not match up with the motion and the action on the screen. With Ska, this doesn't happen. With Ska, there is zero noticeable latency in the audio signal. So you can play your game, watch your movies and videos, just like you could with wired headphones or speakers. And it's really no surprise that Bluetooth has these issues. It was invented over a decade ago for something completely different. It was just adapted for wireless audio. The main focus of SCA is to send high fidelity wireless audio signals. SCA at its core was developed to do this one job very, very well. There's no pairing up devices like you do with Bluetooth, and you can actually send audio to four different receivers at once. So if you wanna share audio to multiple headphones or speakers, you can. For example, two people in the back of a car, on the bus, on the subway, waiting at an airport can watch the same movie, the same video, or even play a two-player game together wearing headphones without disturbing others around them, but the video is coming from the same source, the same phone or tablet. This is impossible with most other technology on the market. SCA is a standard technology that many companies are adopting for use in their own products. Anytime you see the SCA logo on a device, such as headphones or a speaker, you know that it's compatible with SCA transmitters, which also carry that same logo. SCA is an extremely flexible technology that can be adopted for a multitude of wireless audio applications, many of which we'll be talking about in this video series. I hope you guys enjoyed this preliminary introduction to SCA, and please join us as we go through many of the common and expanded functions of the SCA technology. SCA, share audio anywhere.